why did you choose Solax compared to other inverter brands? So when I was looking online, uh, I had a lot of companies canvassing me once I'd shown some interest. And they weren't really answering my questions. Um, and they wanted me to commit to really costly installations without really giving me any education. Well, with Solax it was a very different experience. In fact, the representative from Solax came to my house, uh, didn't put me under any pressure and really educated me on, on the buying process. So after evaluating Solax and a, and a couple of other suppliers, I just felt Solax from a service standpoint, communication standpoint, were quite strong. And I'm vindicated because there have been some small fine tunings that need to be done around backups. And these guys have been on site uh, without question and on call. They've been very, very uh, communicative and, and the, the, they've been coming on site just to tweak things now and again. So I'm really, really impressed with Solax and I'm happy I chose them. How's the experience with you, Solax? Okay, so um, the system was uh, very installed very quickly. I was quite impressed with how fast it was installed and how quick it was operational. Um, the workers were quite organized, kept out of our way, and uh, I was pretty impressed. The equipment looks pretty modern, so I was quite impressed with the whole installation process. I think it took about three to four days to get it all done, which, which I, you know, and uh, it's now been there for four or five months and, and no issues, so quite happy with that. What's your experience on last typhoon? Oh, it was, it was, it was great. In the typhoon, uh, pretty much my whole street was uh, without power, we had power, so I kind of felt a little bit privileged and, uh, how do I say, guilty at the same time, but it was just nice to have power while everybody, everyone else didn't have power, so that was kind of cool. And that's because we installed batteries as well, so that, that helped. And also the upgrade already that we have a 10 kilowatt system. Yes. How's your bill for an AEC? Up, I think 20,000. So we normally, our bills have been going up and up and up. It's no, if you have to look just online, just everyone's really not happy with the AEC charges and that was one of my main motivations to put the system in. Uh, the last few bills have been about half of what we would expect um, and that was before the net metering so we were getting bills for about 10,000 after the installation uh, so I decided to add some more panels to see if we can get that down more um, and at the same time we had net metering installed um, so the last one current day. one day only yeah it was done quite quickly so the net metering I think it kicked in from December and our December bill was 7k where some of our neighbours got bills 20k plus so I was quite happy with Thank you very much, sir. Okay. Yeah.